Right everyone, so I'm joined by Mark. Uh, we're doing something a little bit different for the channel today. We're actually attending the Newcastle's women's game against Chester Lee Street in the third round of the FA Cup qualifying round. So let's get on with it. So Newcastle women got beat in the FA Cup third round qualifying to Neva's Chesley Street but we obviously we were here more to find out more about women's football and Mark what did you make of it today in general? It's a really good game of football, a few controversial decisions that, that, that we've seen there so yeah, put that towards the managers. <laughs> I know that's what we get some controversy from them. To be honest though, the Newcastle women were just like the Newcastle women had a problem with the final third. Yeah, it was. I mean, they went down to 10 men, uh, Chesley Street. There's, they went ahead of first, Chesley Street with, from a corner. And then, you know, they went down to 10 men. Arguably, they should have been sent off earlier if they were 1-1, which was yellow carded outside of the box, which should have been a red card. But the pressure wasn't there. And that golden chance, that 1-1 one one towards the end, if the scores were well, equalised, but Chesley Street go down the other end and score an absolute worldie. Uh, we're going to pop over and interview a couple of the managers. Um, today's game, it's first thoughts are really disappointing obviously with the scoreline but um, I've just told the players indoors that I'm proud of probably 75-80% of the day's game um, I think with possession stats we'll have, have dominated completely uh, chances created dominated completely it's just that element of the game that we can't seem to eradicate where we have a little spell where we drop off our performance levels and it lets teams with good quality like Chester have an opportunity to score and suck a punch with a little bit. Um, 
And then obviously we've created numerous chances and the ball's not went in the back of the net, so it's something we're going to have to look at. I'm not one that really wants to see red cards in a game, I must be honest, but I think when you're through towards goal and you're getting dragged back like that, the referee's got a decision to make, he's got to be brave. Um, but we'll, we'll move on from it, it's fine. Yeah, it's unbelievable really, the one... The person you put your mortgage on to score that goal is the one that's fell to. Uh, Steph, Steph ought to score that nine times out of ten. No problem. Uh, but that's just kind of a little bit how the season started, to be honest with you. Um, we've, we've started the season well, but as far as c converting the chances we create, the percentage is really low. Um, and it's something we're going to have to look at and it's something that the players are going to reflect on and, and we look to, to try and find ways to improve it. But once we do, um, would be really strong, would be really strong. It's really good, it's really good. Um, there's still a lot of things to work on, um, but as far as the players' attitudes and their willingness to train and, 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 and work really hard and listen to what we're trying to coach and implement and our style, our group, I can't fault them. I can't fault them at all, they're fantastic at it. Um, but the, the women's game in general in the area is really good. Um, Chester Street today is strong, Norton and Stockton are strong, Sunderland are above us, strong, Middlesbrough. So in the northeast alone, it's really, really good scene. Um, but there's always big steps out and take forward to try and improve it, really. So we'll, we'll keep looking to try and make them. We're really lucky with the support base that we've got um, externally. So we're, we're really proud of that and the fact that you guys are here today and, and uh, over the last few months, and it's, it's improved a lot and uh, we appreciate that backing and we just we just hope that that just keeps carrying on growing and growing and growing and we'll try to grow the team and the club and the performances on the pitch and we'll see where that takes us ultimately what we need is people more people through the gate to watch because the players are improving week on week the standard of the games is improving week on week but we just need to get people into the into the grounds to watch us so they realize that it's it's happening um, and the more people we can get through the bigger it'll get and it generates other things so it's really important that we just keep striving to, for people to just keep putting it out there that the women's game's there and it's improving and it's viable to watch and it's a good day for the kids the mascots and everything like that so the full package is there we just need more people through the gate if we can